Hello basketball coaches and basketball players, my name is Alan from Al's Basketball Training and today I'm going to show you some amazing 3-on-3 three -three basketball plays that you can run with your 3-on-3 three -three basketball team. So today I'm going to show you some really great Horns basketball plays. Now if you're a coach that runs a Horns basketball offense on a 5-on-5 five -five team, uh, basically you could use these in your practice when you're practicing obviously your plays. Uh, these are fun. You can have quick three on three tournaments that are running these plays, especially if you're running a horns offense. These basically are the same just on half the court. So let's get down to the clipboard and let's check these out. So these are really good horns basketball plays to either teach your team or if you're running three on three to destroy other teams. So to, to start, we're gonna have player five set a screen for player three Player three is going to pop up. He could take that three-point shot to start. Or if player five pops out or if player three fights through, we could have player five rolling towards the basket, in which case he could pop up an easy layup, which would be absolutely fantastic if he could. So you're either going to get a three-point shot or a layup in this play. Now in our next three on three play with the Horns offense, what we're going to do is have player five set a screen for player one Player one is going to use that screen. Player five red could hedge or he could switch. That would be a mistake if they switched. But we're gonna have player five rolling towards the basket. Now, let's say one fights through, player one passes to player five. Five could go in for the layup, but if player five was able to recover fast enough and cover him, we might be able to have either player one set a screen down for player three for a kick out three, or what could happen as well, is we might have player three or player five trailing player three helping out in which case leaves player three either open to drive towards the rim for a layup or for an open three-point shot now in our third play what we're going to have is player five is going to pop out and player one is going to pass player five the ball now what we're going to have is player one cut down whoops down the middle of the court he could be open in this area when he's cutting for a layup if not uh, we're going to have now player three using player one as a screen. I would prefer to have player three going going in front so that player one red doesn't pick off the pass. So if you go in front, this could be an easy layup, left-handed layup for player three blue. Now, what could happen as well is player one could go and switch off so player three doesn't get that layup. If player one blue is able to seal his man, this could be an easy layup for player one as well. Now in our fourth play, what we're going to have now is player five is going to go down and set a screen for player three. Player three is going to go and cut either up across to the free throw line extended or out to, whoops, this wing here. So the, those are the two options for player three. What we're hoping for is player three to run so quick that player five needs to switch off. Player three will then go up to that top the free throw line extended or out to this wing where he will receive that pass in which case now we have a mismatch down low with player three guarding player five usually this is the shorter player in which case we could have an easy layup from player five now in our fifth and final basketball play we're gonna have player five sprint to the other shoulder or the other elbow whatever you want to call it player one is going to pass him the ball now what I want to see is player one going down and setting a screen for player three. Now player three is going to roll up. This could be an open three-point shot. Let's just say they go like this and player one rolls towards the basket. This would be an other option for player three to hit or player five to hit. Or what could happen as well if neither of these players are open, player one could then set a screen and roll for player five at the elbow or the shoulder, which could now operate if player three was to move over to this side could now be a quick very quick easy layup for player five or if they switched because they would probably have to this could be a bounce pass for a layup now those are five plays that you can run as a coach as a drill if you run a horns offense or these could be great three on three basketball plays that you could run if you're playing in your next three on three basketball game. Anyways, I hope that you have enjoyed. If you have, hit that like button and subscribe and I will see you guys again tomorrow because I post videos every single day. I just wanna let you guys know 
that I have another channel called Football Coach Allen. I go over football plays. I am starting to add more and more plays on there. So if you are a football coach as well as a basketball coach, go check that out. You can see it in the link in the description below, but you can also see it as my other channels on the right side of my main YouTube channel, Basketball Coach Allen. So I will see you guys over there, hopefully. Hello, so if you have liked this video, click over here to subscribe or maybe over here, depending on which side I put it on. I don't know yet. Anyways, uh, also the opposite direction or the opposite side is another video you may like. So I hope to see you again in one of those next videos. Yeah.